What's up YouTube? Robert here. This is Rob's Reviews. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing of a Bud K package that I had delivered to me about a week ago. Uh, Bud K is a knife company. Um, so let's get into it. The knife I'm going to be opening that with is a Z Hunter ZB115 Spring Assisted Lime Green Blood Splatter Knife. Let's check it out. Order details, don't need those. They always send you a subscription of their knives, things that are coming out for the next months. Let's see, first thing I got in here is the Night Watchman 500,000 volt stun gun. I had actually picked this up for my wife, so when she goes on walks, um, she has something with her to protect her never know what's gonna go down especially nowadays that's the first thing next thing we got is uh, don't tread on me um, Japanese waterstone knife sharpener uh, pick that up from there that's the second item next thing in this box uh, we have a trailblazer multi-tool and I'd actually pick this one up because it was one of their BOGO uh, deals so bought this one, got that one for free. That's the third item I got in there. Next item is this Tac Warrior um, necklace um, lanyard. It comes with a lanyard. Um, thought that was kind of cool. Picked that up. Uh, I think it was only just a few bucks. Um, that's the fourth item. Uh, next item I got in here, so that's one, two, three, four. Fifth item I got is actually a kissing crane abalone knife. Um, I've always wanted one of these, so I picked this up. Um, that's the fifth item. And the last item in this box. No packaging in this one, just came in cardboard, so I gotta try to take it out. The sheath for it. Take it out. This is their hand forged, they say. Uh, railroad spike, uh, dual edged knife that they have thought that was pretty damn cool so that's the last item I got in this package so what I'm gonna do is I'm actually going to be testing all of this stuff out and I'm gonna do, be doing individual reviews on each one of these so uh, if you liked it give it a thumbs up subscribe um, and check me out next time later